Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Gisterix, and today I'm going to show you how to get the KT4 in Zetsubuno no Shima. There are three parts to getting this wonder weapon, so let's get into it. The first part is a plant, and it's located in the bunker. You go down the back door, go down the stairs, and there'll be another door to open on the right. Once you're in the water, follow the route that I take, and make sure you come up for air every couple seconds so you don't drown. You go down the tunnel with the shiny blue crystals, and you'll eventually get to the bottom. Grab the plant, shoot the orange bubble to get more air, then swim back up. Do this quickly or you might drown. The next part is the spider's venom. To get this, you need to have the full power on. I'll have a tutorial up soon on how to do this. Next, you need to make your way to lab A, go up the stairs and lower the cage like I am. Then you need to wait for a spider round. Spider rounds come every 5 or 6 rounds, so don't worry. You need to go under lab A where you will find the lowered cage, then trail a spider into it. Once the spider's in the cage, climb the stairs, raise the cage, and wait about 10 seconds for the needle to get the venom, and then collect it from the tube next to it. The last piece is random. This piece will come at any round after you've collected the first piece from the KT4. To get this piece, you'll need to kill a zombie that is glowing green, and the piece will drop. For some people, you could get it on round 9. For others, a lot longer. I got it on round 18. Once you have all three pieces, go back into the bunker, into the back door, go down the stairs again, and there will be a special workstation for you to craft your wonder weapon at the back left. Pressing the shoot button once will only do a small effect on a couple of zombies, but if you hold the button down, it will do a three burst trigger on the ground and kill a swarm of zombies that walk on it. Thanks for watching my video guys, I hope this helped you. If it did, make sure to like the video and comment what other tutorials I should do. Again, thanks for watching, bye guys.